Well, I missed making my Thanksgiving deadline, but let's try to... Missing the cap off a bottle. Let's try to get some done. Maybe we'll make it next year. Gonna go with some shadowed stone. 9085. And what I'm going to do... Labeled up here. Labeled up. I have no idea what that was supposed to mean. I am going to do the ribbon under her bonnet in that color. I was going to do it as black, but I think black would just be too stark on this. So instead we're going with a dark gray. Again, my use of the royal we. That's probably going to be pretty shaded. So I try to paint this where you can see it and I can see it. I may have a problem with not enough color on the edges. So I may have to do like a dark brown wash or something. Let's go ahead and get these. And it's starting to look pretty thin paint. Looks like the actual focus is behaving today. And since it's been so long since I've done any of this, I don't remember what I said I was going to do off camera last time. Don't laugh while you're painting. Destroys your brush control. And so I'll probably have to take my glasses off and paint the rest of that, but you get the idea. And I'm going to go ahead and paint the ribbon on the back of her dress in the same color, being the thrifty little mouseling she is. She has a tendency just to use the same ribbon on one outfit. That's my story, and let's stick into it. Watch what you're doing. Okay, so done with that. Oh, and then I grabbed another color. We can use our fair skin 9047. I've already mixed it up and pushed it out. And this time remembering to put the cap on. And since I have not used this paint recently, it gets the paint dot on the top. Nope. I don't know why I washed that off, but I did. So, what I'm going to do with that is her tail is going to get painted a fair skin color. I was going to go with punk rock pink, but I think that would just be way too pink. I think it's light furred as she is. Now you're not going to be able to see, but I'm getting behind on the tail. I'd like to get, there's some blue from the dress, on the tail that you'd be able to see from looking at that direction.
It's hard to paint that to begin with. So we're going to get her tail. Then I'm going to boop her on her nose. And of course I messed up the boop. So let's just back the paint off there. Dry it a little bit. We'll go to the third thing. It's going to paint the inside of her ears. One, there's two. Now, let's see if I can dot the nose better this time. <laughs> nope. So We'll do that with glasses off. All those wiping it off here. I think I actually got it decent. I'm not sure the camera will show her nose if I even get up here really close. No. Let's see if I put my head behind. Nope. And I bumped the camera. Okay. So the last thing I was going to do is there's these two little leaves here. Get a good view of it. And, you know, I've got the green right there and I've got the brown right there, so I, I kind of don't want to make it green or brown. So, we'll do a drop of each. It's not a very good drop, but it is. I guess that's not true. Just a quick mix to make it a dark green. And onto the leaves there. So, am I even showing it? Probably not. Anyway, that's all I had planned for this little video. Got to do it in short bursts. Next, we'll do the grapes and the ground. We'll see you in the